Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Edith and today we are going to be cash stuffing our cash envelopes and sinking funds for the second week of January. Hopefully you are having a great weekend or week. Um, I have been still a little bit under the weather. I just can't seem to sh shake whatever I have off. Um, it's been crazy. Like I felt great for two days and then the weekend I just, I was so sick on Friday and Saturday all over again. And finally today I'm starting to feel like myself again, but I've, I've had like a couple of tests done, um, and they've all come back negative. So I really don't know what's going on. I think it's just allergy related, but it it's, it's it's a lot it's a lot and hopefully today it stays you know like I said I've been feeling great today so hopefully you know I wake up tomorrow feeling awesome as well so enough of that let's go ahead and I'm gonna go over the budget for this um, second half of this paycheck so remember I do get paid um, twice a month and starting the new year I decided to stuff all of my envelopes including my bills my sinking funds my cash envelopes weekly instead of um, every two weeks um, I was filling my or I was stuffing my cash envelopes um, every week last year but um, I decided to just do everything weekly so let me go into the budget so that you can see what I am talking about. Okay. This one? Yes. Okay. So, um, you know what? Let me go back to my monthly. Okay. So, for my first paycheck in of the year, I projected I was going to get paid $1,400. I did get paid $1,410. I left the $10 in the account. And um, for the first stuffing of the year what I did is I divided the 1400 into two which is 700 but I also used the 227 in my prior stuffing to get me ahead of um to get me ahead in some of the categories but this week we're only doing 700 so that means only a few of our sinking funds are going to be getting stuffed and hopefully, um, I've been working a whole lot more um, this last week. So hopefully, um, our paycheck will go back to normal when we get paid mid, um, mid January. So, you know, at least we're taking care of our bills, um, our essentials, and our cash envelopes that need to be stuffed. And then these right here are sinking funds that definitely, definitely have to be stuffed. So remember, I am stuffing all of my bills, which include car loan, car insurance, um, cell phone, monthly subscriptions, and kids insurance into one envelope versus five or six different ones. So that this week is getting 262. Our utilities are getting $5. Um, and that is so low because I did have some amount in my bill pay account that I am going to use to cover um, February's. Um, utilities um, annual is getting 10 trash disposal is getting three internet is getting 15 uh, debt snowball which is going towards the husband's car loan will be getting 75 gas is 100 um, groceries is 20 personal I'm getting nothing kids fun is 10 eat out is 20 and daycare is 60 property tax is getting 40 car registration 10 health and um, health is getting 10 um, work um, expenses is getting 40 the hubby needs to buy some some work gear so that'll be $40 and miscellaneous is getting the rest $20 figure I put it in miscellaneous and try to divide it into all of the categories so that way if I run over in any other category I can grab it from miscellaneous so that leaves us with zero dollars so let's get to this cash stuffing Okay, guys, so let's go ahead and give this money account. Make sure it's $700. I have $100, $200, $250, $300, $400, $500, $600, $700, $800, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,000, $1,
420, 440, 460, 480, 500, 20, 40, 60, 80, 600, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 700, okay? So we have $700 here. Okay, we're going to start off with my wallet. Now, I did finish it, guys. It's And it's nothing fancy. I did repurpose these. These were in my bills binder. So what I did is I cut some of it off so that it would fill in, fit into this wallet. And um, I just made these labels using a, a label printer or whatever. So um, personal is getting nothing and it has nothing. Daycare is getting $60. 20, 40, 60. Gas, um, I usually put 10, I mean, sorry, I usually put 20 in here just in case I need to pump cash somewhere that doesn't take like a debit card or a credit card. So I'm putting 20 here and then the remaining 80 will go into our cash envelope binder over there. Um, Kids Fun is getting... Ten dollars, but I think it has ten dollars. So this will be for a rollover. I'm gonna put that right there. Um, I'm gonna do two fives. Is that what I did? Hang on. Oh no, I did a ten dollar bill. That's fine. We'll do a ten dollar. Okay. Um, eat out is getting twenty dollars, but it has some rollover as well. That was five, six, seven, eight, nine, and rollover. So Eda was getting 20. Okay, don't do a $20 bill there. Um, and then this is back to bank. Let's, let's go into oh, I forgot my bills binder. Forgot this guy here. Okay. Um, let's see. Utilities is getting five dollars. And utilities has 10 now. Trash is only getting three dollars. One two three so trash disposal now has 150 55 56 57 58 59 uh 61 61 161 in here annual is getting ten dollars annual now has 120 40 50 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69. 169, is that correct? Let's do that again. 120, 40, 50, 60, 60, wait. 5, 66, 67, 60, 69. Yes, okay, 169, that was right. Okay, internet is getting $15. And guys, we're getting closer to the amount that I need in here to install our internet. I'm so excited. You guys don't know what I have to go through to upload these videos, but it is what it is. Internet has 100, 200, 210, 220, 225, 230, 235. Yes, 235 in internet. Okay, our bills is getting $262. Oh. 62, okay. So 100, 200, 50, 60, 162. How much we have in here now? Okay, let's give this a count. Okay, our bills now has 100, 200, 300, 400, 50, 500, 510, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 524 in our bills. It's not bad. Okay, Dead Snowball is getting $75. Um, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85. Okay. 
So it now has 100, 100, 50, 100, 20, 40, 45, 50. 150 in Dead Snowball. Okay, that's it for our Bills Binder. Okay, next up is our some of our cash envelopes. Um, not a lot is getting stuffed. Beauty is not getting anything. Fun is not getting anything. Gas is getting the remaining $80. But let's see how much we have here that we can roll over. 20, 40, 60, 80. Guys, last week, um, I brought down my, um, my budget for gas and I managed to just do... I think it was under a hundred and I usually do like I said 120 so me not driving around so much really helped so um I have 20 40 60 80 1 20 40 60 wait I have 20 40 60 80 1 20 40 60 I'm gonna do 40 and roll over I should be good with 120 let's give that a try 120 Okay. and um, groceries is getting 20 and if you're new to my channel I'm only doing 20 in this category because my kids attend a public school in the state of California and we did get a pandemic EBT card in the mail for them so obviously we've been using that but I still continue to stuff a smaller 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 amount here to you know bulk it up for when we run out of those um funds in the ebt card we'll have some money saved up so groceries now has 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 20 30 so 230 in here okay haircuts is not getting anything um household is not getting kids is not um uh, personal I wanted to put some money in rollover. Um, hmm, how much should I do? Okay, well, I'm only going to do 12. And so now I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 92. 92 in my personal plus some gift cards. Okay, guys, so um, I've been really thinking about getting a Cricut, um, not to open an Etsy shop just yet because I feel like I'm, I'm not very tech savvy, so it would need, I would need a lot, a lot, a lot of practice and looking up YouTube videos and on how to work a Cricut, okay? But I do want to buy one, I just don't know which one. If you, if any of you out there own a Cricut, I need you to comment down below. Tell me which one you have and why you like it and why should I buy that one. Remember, I'm a beginner, but maybe down the line I would like to open an Etsy shop. Um, yeah, but that would be like months and months away, okay? <laughs> it's not. So I have time to learn and, you know, practice and you know, perfect things, but I do want to buy one. I do have, you know, um, two $50 gift cards. Yeah. To Michael's. And then I have, um, a $100 gift card to Amazon and then a, another hundred dollars in Amazon credit, um, that I can put towards my purchase, but I just don't know. I don't know which one to get basically. So help me out. Okay. Help me out. <laughs> Okay, Pets is not getting anything. Um, miscellaneous was getting the 20. So miscellaneous now has 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. And I'm not going to take anything from miscellaneous because, yeah, miscellaneous is going to be our buffer for any of these other categories. Okay, and that is it for our cash envelopes. Okay, up next are our sinking funds. Birthdays is not getting anything. Car maintenance is getting nothing. No, car maintenance is not getting anything. Okay. 
Car registration is one that we definitely want to put at least $10 in here. So now it has 20, 30, 40 in car registration. Okay. Clothing and shoes is not getting anything. Copays is not getting anything. Date night, gifts, health. Health is getting $10. And let's take everything out. And it has just $1 in there right now. Plus 10. Uh, that would be 11. Okay, $11 in health. Holidays, nothing. House, nothing. Um, nothing. Property taxes was getting forty dollars. Twenty, forty. This one we definitely need to bulk up because um, March. I need to pay these again. So one hundred twenty, forty, sixty, one sixty, and I think the amount was five eighty three minus one sixty. I have to. Oof. 423. 423. I have left there two stuff. Okay, work expenses was getting $40. 2040. That's our last 40. 20, 40, 51. So 51 in work expenses for the husband. And that's it. Okay, guys. So let's see how much we have in rollover. I might regret putting these in rollover in the middle of the week. But, hey, you know what? I told my husband, we're going to use this week as a, a minimal spending kind of week because my paycheck was so low. And he was like, well, you can grab $200 for my paycheck if you want. I said, no, we're, we're that's not the point. The point is that money needs to go directly to the savings and we're going to have to make it work with what we have. So, you know what? We're going to make it work. So, let's see. In rollover, I have 20, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71. Okay, $71 in our rollover. We're going to put it in here before I forget. Okay, and we have to stuff our saving challenges pretty soon. Um, okay, guys, they have a and we'll get the triggers. Okay, so that'll be for our savings challenge video. Okay, guys, well, this concludes this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you on our next video. Bye.